You know, I'm trying to figure out what's going on. People call me God, and I ask for things, and they appear and stuff like that. I'm like, okay, maybe there's an alien demon race on this planet who creates things at a faster rate than uh, the mentally defunct humans could understand. And even I don't understand. And... One of those things was when people come into my life, right? Like, okay, I'm running for president. I'm vastly involved in this and that and all sorts of stuff. Uh, maybe I right? should be specific because it is specific. You know, like makeup and looking good, physical fitness, all this. Uh, um, you know, basically making videos. So, I get sent a person who works with Donald Trump, travels the world, works with, somehow, magically works with the people who run my hillbilly city, which is, I mean, it's hillbillies, but it's a, actually a real large city. I'm not sure they know math, so none of them know it. Uh, I had to look it up myself to know it, because people here thinks it's like a, a farm town, and it's like actually fucking massive. But, uh, I mean, literally, there is a farm in the middle of the town because they worship, they call themselves Cowtown. But anyways, okay, so these things kept happening, and I know, like, I kept noticing throughout my life, wow, I don't get along, I must, like, not fit in here because every person I've ever dated is from outside Columbus, Ohio. Um... So, I, like, I, apparently I must travel far and wide to meet a beautiful person, to meet an intelligent person, to meet an active person. That's what I kept thinking, right? But, you know, it just dawned on me yesterday with the, with the advent of me learning on the creator, then, um, what is happening, well, like, when I was traveling, like, thousands of miles across the world type stuff. Um, like the cities, the buildings, the situations, the maps, the road layout, everything was like laid in a way that was talking to me. And I was like, hell no. This is, these people did not build this 10,000 years ago, realizing someday where some fool's going to come, we're going to convince us God. And... Uh, we have all this set up to make him think this is really happening and we're going to, he's going to bring peace to the world once we manipulate him far enough and stuff. And I just dawned on me yesterday with the whole simple thing I ask for people or items or anything and then traveling the cities as if the, and the cities sometimes appear as if they didn't exist at all until that specific moment in time where I were to arrive at them. These people, I was worried, were being hired to come into my life. You know, like, uh, I'm running for president. If you have uh, two brain cells, um, get a hold of me, bro. Like, we are, we have to form some sort of group here. Because we're going to die off, but let's just hang out until the others kill us off, right? So, um, we don't have a chance. Uh, unless that's what the new world order is. is uh, 7,000 people out of 14 billion on the planet with some brain cells. And, yeah, I'm supposed to be the good guy. I can't say that stuff, right? I, I like to mess around with it, but whatever. So, uh... I'm like, bro, these people are from out of town because those places haven't been invented yet. And when I have thoughts, it has to come from something that's new. And they told me this too. They said, you have to go somewhere new for it to be inventive. So I should, technically, there's a one in a million chance I should just throw everything away again. Like I have... Five times, three, three times, well, three times in the past four years, um, threw away all my awesome stuff to move on. And then 
they told me that too when I was traveling. Like whatever, I don't, I don't think it's a they. It tells me it's me. So it's like the me on the outside. You know what I'm saying? Like the this is the avatar shell it sends in to get punched and kicked by the humans and all that stuff. And it sits on the outside. Like oh my god, <laughs> it's so funny. And I'm sitting there like, wow, oh my. God. God, we're gonna have to really mess one up now, aren't we? And it just keeps going on. No, let's get this over. Anyways, um, yeah, so that happens, and I realize like a, you know what the game generating people and all that? It's pretty much having to generate people from different cities, isn't it? Because it's having to generate something I haven't seen yet. I'm sure of it. I can't look. I mean, I say like everything came to me in like one second when I needed it to, like a couple times in my life uh, when revelations occurred and stuff. But uh, I, I, I like I, I've been trying to rule out the alien thing, especially if I am like the god. Like I can't invent that there's something else above me because. That's the end of it. And yeah, like, they use that as an excuse. Whether, if there is an alien demon race you cowards worship who is enslaving us and stuff and do nothing about them while them to do that and I'm the only one who attempted to break through the wall, then, yeah, they could come to me and set some things up. But if I'm actually inventing this stuff, then uh, the game... They, the game, told me that I have to go to new places for new stuff to happen. And it really worked that way. Like, there's a hell of a lot of human involved in some of these things I've been through. I don't trust a damn one of them or what I've seen. But I've seen it, and it happened, and I'm here. You want to question that? Let's have a little discussion about who I am, what I've been through. I'll tell you about six months of who I am. And you can tell me what you've been through your whole life. Okay? Because there's stuff I'm not even talking about. Okay? Things. Oh. And it makes me just as paranoid as it does grateful to be the king of all creation and not know it's like if I am creating things that know I'm the creation because it didn't happen until I realized I am no one came and told me that all of the weird stuff happened before but no one told me until I said that so I don't trust it either way really but um when all these people I met are from like different states all over and I want nothing to do with someone who's far away. I want someone who I can be beside, especially nowadays. I need a freaking warrior at my side. And to me and her, anyone who looks like them, acts to the forehead, you know, they, it's going to be like 24 7 rumble. You know what I'm saying? Give me a Hulk Hogan looking bitch. No, not at all, bro. Sorry, I don't like men. I think they look like mutants, but hey. They know what we can do. <laughs> so they like us. <laughs> Free, damn, I just figured that out. Why do females like men? Because you go, fuck them. Uh, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Nothing like that. You could give them a few dollars. Buy them, a, buy them some extra cheese on the burger that they would have bought for you if you would have just slapped them before. You show them how you can slap some people. Anyways, yeah, when these motherfuckers appear, how comes everyone I know, not even females, they're from somewhere else? You tell me every other city just full of actors they're hiring to send. Sean wants someone like you. Go, and they're like, ooh, I'm wet already. I can't wait. Mm, or, or, yeah, bro, they're so fun. We're going to go ahead and destroy everything. No, I think it's because 
the invention can't be done where I'm already at.